Hello fellow learners, this is the second video of this series. We will continue to make the rest of the UIs and animations for this website. But specifically in this video we will be building this second section and third section. Without any further wait let's get right into the video. Ok let me create the second section widget in a separate file. I will move the second section to the top, so that we don't have to scroll every time down to see the output. Let's see what we have until now. We will be using the similar kind of animation here as well, that we saw in the first section. If you haven't watched the first video yet, I will leave the video link in the description. Do check it out for the explanation on the animation part. We will use the future delayed for triggering the animations for now, then in the last video we will see how to trigger the animation on scroll. Ok, as you can see the title of the second section is complete now, even the animation is completed easily, with the text reveal widget that we created in the last video. Now it's time to create the item cards, which displays name, image, description, and price of the dishes. We will be using wrap widget here, instead of row or column widget, so that it can be responsive and support any screen size from mobile to desktop. Let me lead with the list of integers to show you how it looks, then we will create some static data of items.
Okay, that's it for the second section, let's start building the third section now.
Right, we have completed the UI part, let me explain this animation here. We are using animated cross fade widget, which takes two child, our first child will be an empty container with the same size as our second child. Our second child will be the actual widget, which we need to reveal. So once the cross fade state changes, the first child will transition into second child with a fade. Okay now it is revealing itself from center as expected. That's it for today, stay tuned for the next video, in which we will complete the rest of the sections and will trigger the animations with scroll. Goodbye.